everybody wants to be the one of one. Everybody wants mm-hmm. to be the different guy Shout or the different the person. You know what I'm saying? Like, <sighs> Shout out to the idol. She wants because she wants to be a one in a generation should, artist. Yeah, we'll talk about that later. I don't, I don't <laughs> yeah. even want to talk about that. But I guess no, it is a good segue because we were in this. We were talking about soundtracks. Yeah, so it's a good segue because we'll get off that because we'll talk about other stuff forever. But um, yeah. So this is a music podcast, and we were talking about film earlier. We were. Uh, mm-hmm. We're kind of still talking about film because we're talking about the Idol, which is a new Max, not HBO Max, not HBO, because it's just Max now. He's exactly. cool. He's a teenager. He's got a nickname. He's in the no. streets. Got street cred. Max Blonde hair uh, Yeah yeah Highlights Slick shit. back yeah, Exactly <laughs> Type shit Went sagging his jeans a little bit Exactly you know what I'm saying? Maybe, maybe untied shoelaces on purpose exactly. As a choice Style DCs. choice Yeah exactly Yeah <laughs> on, for real Maybe like a, a chain wallet You know what oh, I'm saying Oh yeah definitely yeah. a chain yeah, wallet yeah, Leather sure. Black leather Yeah Maybe even one of those belts with the like Studs, studs? on it yeah. Hell yeah Yeah Max Yeah Shout out to that guy But yeah Because uh, <laughs> now that HBO Max is Max They have Premiered a show with one Abel Tesfay, I believe that's how you say it. I'm the not, weekend. Yo, it's the weekend. It's the weekend. <laughs> I, hey, shout out to all my motherfucking Ethiopians. Shout out you to did. all my uh, uh, East Africans. Shout out to all you my uh, 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 Eritreans. Shout out to you all, you know what I'm saying? All my Habishas, bro. Shout out to y'all, you man. Dig. If I've said that wrong, I'm so sorry. Shout out to all the Habibis. Y'all know that. That's crazy. <laughs> I mean, shout out to them shout too. Out to them, shout, out to them too. <laughs> shout out to the community. <laughs> shout out to the community, bro. Hey, man. The community, all the community. All the com- Literally, we no. Got, we, nah, nah, nah. Shout out. We, no, well, not shout out all the communities, but we, we love all the communities. Even if with the, even if they're not good people, we got to show them love because they, they low-key need it the most. They need it the most, so we got we still got to shout out. I mean, it's still still low key fuck them sometimes. Hey, but we still let's just show say them love. I'll just say that I need to do a bit more therapy before mm-hmm. I can agree with that. That's, I get that's it. Real. I'll keep it that. I'll keep I, it real. I get it because I cannot agree with that to some extent. So the, There's e- some e- people who I very much, like. I'm still in that. I don't think I'm a violent person, but I still have times where like I know of a certain. Uh, like I see stuff on the internet all the time. I'm oh like, yeah. If, oh, yo, if this happened in front of me, there's I don't. How else would I react? Yeah. I would yeah, only be able to put. I would only be able to physically react. Only. Same. There's no way else. Like that video I just sent to the earlier. That bitch would have got. I, I Dog, she would have got hey, dropped. Yo, kicked, we do bro. not condone. I, 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 literally, I'm telling you, I was raised right. I don't even believe. I don't want. I don't believe in hitting anyone. I don't want to put my hands. I don't. Exactly. I have to unless it's self defense. Ex- even then, like. If there's a way I can de-escalate, exactly. I would prefer. And I'm not pussy, nigga. I'm not no <laughs> bitch. I'm just non-confrontational because exactly. the reality is confrontations with me really only lead one place that I don't want to go. Exactly. And so, um, because like the reality is, when you by the time you consider it a confrontation, yeah. a conflict, then it's like, all right, my nigga, what do you want to do about it? Exactly. Like what? Not not what are you going to? What do you want to do? Like where do you want to go with this? Like because as of now, now there's there's a problem to you. Mm-hmm. So how do you want to solve this? Exactly. Because if you want to do that, we could do that. So just I, know I, I, I didn't I want, to, want to. Just know I, I didn't want, want to, to do that. But I'll do but it let's if do I that have then. to. If that's what you want to do, let's do yeah. it. <laughs> but anyways, nah, man. I like I said, not not non confrontational, man. But like, there are just some subsects of people, just human beings, man. I think as I think humankind, I think as a species here on this rock, we got yeah. going on. I do have love for. Yeah. I have love for and I have faith in. However. Y'all be tripping. (laughs) Nigga. (laughs) Y'all niggas niggas be be tweaking, boy. Y'all be tweaked. I I can't even lie. I'm tweaking. I can't say say no. no. I'm tweaking. Also, we could get into that real quick. Oh, re- yeah. re- spin the block back to Metro. <laughs> spin the block back to Metro for one second. Shout this is the Metro episode. Some tangents. <laughs> yeah, oh God. <laughs> Shout out. This, is, this is the Metro episode, man. But like, um, that uh, Heroes and Villains joke, yeah. uh, I, I'll still f- stand firmly in the fact that I think the best song in that project is the damn interlude. Yeah. And Don is on that one. Yep. And that's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not better than well, Can't uh, Say, but it's not bad. Honestly, what I got to say, though, I can't. I, I can't just Maybe count. Comfy. I, can't, I personally don't count the interlude as one song, though. Oh, because of, yeah, because me, me, Metro Spider. Yeah, yeah. Into that interlude, Metro. Oh my god! And you know, Doug put his whole dick on that. I verse, knew bro. you was about to say. He some fucking... wiped his whole <sighs> schlong on that verse twice. That shit was crazy. 
that nigga talked like he knew he was about to be in some shit, and y'all needed to know what the fuck the vibes were. I will agree with that. That was definitely that a man talking, who knew he was bro. not going to be dropping music for a minute. Was yeah, definitely, he said, I got to let y'all off with something real and if that, good. And, real if that, and if it wasn't the case and that was like an old verse, then I want to know what he was going I want to know yeah. what was going on in his life when he did that. Exactly. Because that the, nigga the shit was he's talking, talking about in that verse, bro. He was talking. That's, that shit was deeper than rap. Deeper bro. than rap. And I mean, shit, I guess since we're talking about Thug and his situation, we might as well get into one of the new releases we were talking about. Let's slide yeah. that way. Skirt, uh, skirt. Wanna back? Wanna. Wanna back. Not a running back, no. but wanna back. <laughs> that boy, not wanna a runner back. Good. <laughs> That boy gonna back, wanna, man. Wanna, wanna, gonna. It's so weird, man, because I'm not gonna lie. As um Okay. So as an artist who is yeah. not a street nigga, yeah, but was adjacent to street niggas who were also artists, yeah, at a point in time, I'm respectful of people's codes and yeah. their opinions and how things should work. Yeah. But that nigga did not snitch on me. That shit is hard. That shit is <laughs> hard, bro. That shit is hard. It's a good fucking song, bro. And I don't know what I don't know the specifics of the situation. I know y'all are like, how you not know the specifics? Y'all over the internet. I'm not chronically online, bro. Like I go to the internet and most socials for jokes, for yeah. entertainment. Like, oh God. Like if you creeping on my shit, you lurking on my shit, trying to find some shit, you're only gonna find jokes and memes. Like I don't take that Yo, shit jokes, serious. Jokes. Um, Memes I, and yeah. uh, survival shit because America's about to go oh. shit. But you know, <laughs> learn some shit. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> learn but yeah, some shit. but like yeah, man, like um, I got think pieces every once in a while, but it's really only when I feel like yo, nobody is using their fucking brain right now. Yeah, and yeah. that's I guess that's narcissistic because why the fuck is my brain the one that you know? But sometimes I just be like, yo, let me get this off my chest. Yeah, because there's just no way y'all niggas aren't. How did y'all not make those connections? But then again, you know. If you've ever yeah, been on, the, be if you've ever been him. on the road, like if you've ever driven around other human beings, which I'm sure a lot of us <laughs> have, uh, you know, what you would know that on, people bro. don't really be using their fucking brain. So I guess it, give them a fucking screen, and they don't even have to move around and nothing like that. Why would they not be fucking yeah, stupid? Exactly. On there? So <laughs> they, they know what they're doing. Yeah, man. Shout out technology. Shout out the dumbasses. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Shout out to the dumbasses on the technology. Uh, yeah, man. <laughs> Whew. Uh, We'll, that's another thing, but <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, the bread and butter track, man. I um, I hope the best for that situation. Mm. Like everybody involved, I think there is only really one person that is actually fucked, and that's Thug's yeah. brother, Unfunk. Yeah, we had an episode where we did go over the like way back. Mm -hmm. We went over the slime language. Don't yeah. we were talking about how Unfunk had just came out of prison yep. and did that track and got put on a project, and then boom, and that nigga violated his parole and is got what now nine years. I'm not even hip. I'm not even sharp. I think because he had a life sentence, got out early, and now they're basically making him do the remainder of his sentence. Supposedly, he was talking more more than gonna. Supposedly, I didn't, not, I didn't we're not, hear that. We're not gonna that's, get why, that's why I said supposedly, we're not, allegedly. I'm not, I'm not getting into who talked or who spoke on what or any of that. I don't know. Man. That's what I'm saying. So, suppose, I that, so, this, this, so I just got to say this, though. If that's if that's what uh, the, 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 the people are saying, that's what the papers are saying. This is what I will say. Where the heat on him? On though? behalf of all of my black brothers behind yeah. uh all my black brothers in general, but all my black brothers who are in the music industry and behind bars now, it is not coincidental that labels target young men with very poor circum poor life circumstances, mm -hmm. um, very harsh realities, and take them from situations that are harmful to them and the people around them, and then put them in a spotlight, put them on a pedestal, and then make them not necessarily make them but yeah kind of make them in a way if you want to eat you kind of got to promote and glorify yep. a certain lifestyle yeah um whether that's a lifestyle you're currently in or a lifestyle you're trying to get away from it's not a coincidence that they want that for you and then you end up behind bars and mm -hmm. they're moving on to the next nigga who can give them that. exactly it's not coincidental um I don't want to speak on nobody. So this, this, I mean, inter this interviews yeah, I, with label executives talking about it, bro. There's it's, it, it, so this it's one of the breakfast, also uh, one of the Breakfast Club. I, again, conspiracy. We we never got a conspiracy button, but we go get yeah. that motherfucker. Da, 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 da. <laughs> <Yeah>, conspiracy <laughs> button. <laughs> uh, there is a couple of different corporations that happen to be 
parent companies of some private prisons as mm-hmm. well as parent companies of some fucking labels. Oh, really? And that's kind of crazy. That that is, is that, crazy. That's a wild pipeline. But whoa, mm. two of the tangents. We're not gonna talk about <laughs> that. Let's go. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah, crazy. Man. <laughs> they gonna be that dope. <laughs> nah, man. Um, do your research. <laughs> that's, <it. laughs> Learn something. that's the tag for this episode. Do your research. <laughs> But um, yeah, man. Um, yeah, it's just not coincidental, man. And I don't. I think that's exactly what they want. They build a case, um, with all of these young black artists and uh, executives. They built a case around some things that they may or may not have been involved in. They built a case around these niggas for years mm-hmm. of their life, mm-hmm. and they built that case knowing that. The internet was what it was. The streets are what they are. The labels are what they are. And eventually, people will... If you pit people against each other, what have they... The reason why they got famous was survival. Yeah. So what are they going to continue to do? Exactly. Try to survive. And y'all can call it what y'all want. Y'all can adhere to whatever code you want. We already know the United States government has never at any point in time... Never. ...wanted to see us, like... This they don't want to see niggas like this. They don't want to see that, yeah. bro. They, they don't want, want us to have breakfast. They don't want us to have breakfast. Actually, I'm just going to spell a little myth here. Yeah, they want us to have breakfast a little bit because it, it, I'm about to, I'm about to speak to y'all. The human body is actually really only made to eat once a day. They want us to eat three times a day. It's only supposed to eat once. We're not not only supposed. We have evolved to eat three times a day and be yeah. on this clock. Yeah. But we were initially not. You could eat. And then go and travel and hunt and do things for almost a 24 hour, 25, 26 hour span before you needed to like replenish. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, obviously, you were resting that time frame, but the, you do know, everybody knows after you eat, you get tired. Yeah. So if you wake up first thing in the morning, yes, you need to put something in your body for energy because that's how energy works. Yeah. But you don't necessarily, you know, what is the balanced breakfast they be putting on TV? Cereal, then you got eggs and bacon on the side, and yeah. then you got an orange as well, and then you got like a pastry over here, yeah. a cup of orange juice, and a Bunch cup of, of milk, shit. and a cup of It's like, nobody actually eats like that, but there are people out there who think that they're supposed to eat like that. Yeah. Because. People out here drinking milk with their breakfast. Stop drinking milk drinking in general. cow's milk Every, and shit. Hashtag everybody is lactose intolerant. Exactly. That's not just a specific You're thing. Not hashtag. Slow. Everybody's like, if y'all knew the amount of pus and blood that be coming into the milk and br- bra. Yeah, y'all don't want to know. This ain't even really tunes and tangents no more. We really, really, we, we talking some real shit to y'all. We te- Hashtag learn yeah, something, we, we, bro. We really just, we teach it. <laughs> oh, man. But nah, um, yeah, man. Uh, I really hope the best for the YSL situation. But like I said, um, niggas got to wake up. Niggas got to stop being so uh, internet oriented. Mm-hmm. Gotta stop being so like silly and goofy, especially these young niggas, Bruh. these kids. Like these niggas is tripping. I be seeing niggas li- like niggas are literally exposing other niggas' IP addresses on the internet because they disagree with them literally. about some niggas who don't even know y'all exist. Literally, that shit bro. is crazy to me, bro. Like young thug gonna like Dick anybody, riding. Like, bro. It's not even riding at this point, my nigga. It's like you're trying to become one with his penis. Yes. Like you're trying. You are the dick. You, like you're, yes. Exactly. You're literally trying to become his dick now at this point. <laughs> because what the fuck, bro? How do you, like you're willing to expose someone's home address, like their location? You know what I'm saying? Expose their person, life. Literally, just because they disagree with you on the internet about. A situation that you're not involved in, and the niggas who are involved in it have literally no idea either one of y'all exists, and probably could give less of a fuck about no, y'all opinion y'all because they're about. in fucking jail. <laughs> they like, do not give a fuck about a what y'all are talking about shit, on the internet, bro. <laughs> like that shit is so crazy. Y'all niggas gotta get it together, get it the fuck together, bro. Uh, so <laughs> that's just crazy. But yeah, I hope the best for YSL, man. Um, Same, but honestly, that still ties back to what you were talking about earlier. There's a reason why they use these labels, use these people because. They know, they know that they're going to get these younger people, these Man. younger generations Man. up on it. And it's, well, that Man. Way, it's a cycle, bro. Man, we it's ain't a cycle. saying nothing that we ain't. Man. It's Look. a cycle, bro. Look, man, we ain't saying nothing wrong. Y'all just ain't listening right. Shout out to the independents, though. Yeah, we ain't saying nothing wrong. Y'all just ain't listening right. But yeah, man, Crazy. I don't even really know how we slide from that, man. 